Hey guys, uh, back to show you how uh, to set up the email event action. So once you get get it to email you, uh, you go in and I'll just give you one example and they'll all work the same. Uh, fan locked fault, and you click on that. And then you come over here to, you can set it up to uh, event the record, a warning message, warning messages or uh, have it email you. That way it'll just event it in the event log here. Uh, you can look at it when you get home and see how it's what's going on. But the whole purpose is setting it up for the email. Uh, once you get your email set up and then you go into your event action and then you just go along and pick the ones you want it to uh, email you over if the action happens like if the battery is disconnected or the current CT failed battery short uh, I think I'm gonna go in and click them all um, and hopefully the thing will never email me because I guess it would be in the event of some kind of failure but at least you would know about it right away so that's a pretty awesome part of the system. Uh, even my utility company isn't that on the ball. So thank you MPP for doing an awesome job with the software and uh, uh, great job with the unit. Thanks.